Bill, it's good to be with you. Probably great to be with you. I know that you've written a new book called What Every American Needs to Know About the Quran. Tell us, what does every American need to know? Well, a bunch of interesting facts, like uh, Columbus would have never set sail to find a sea route to India and China in 1492, had not 40 years earlier the Muslims conquered Constantinople, the Christian capital of Europe, which cut off the land routes to India and China. And uh, then Captain John Smith had founded Virginia. He's called Captain because he spent five years fighting the Muslims over in Hungary before he founded Virginia. And then the Pilgrims. Uh, in 1620, they founded Massachusetts. In 1625, they sent some ships back to England filled with dried fish and beaver skins to trade for supplies. And William Bradford writes in the history of the Plymouth Settlement that the ships made it all the way across the Atlantic and were in the English Channel within sight of Britain when a Turkish man of war captured one of the ships, took it down to Morocco and sold the crew into slavery. And uh, then the first war after our revolution was the Barbary Pirate War. The Muslims captured our American sailors, stuck them in the dungeons of Algiers, Tunis, and Tripoli. And uh, Thomas Jefferson sent in our Marines. And that's where we get the Marine anthem from the halls of Montezuma to the shores of Tripoli, Tripoli, North Africa. And so we see these intersections in American faith. And so I, I touch on that, but it allows us to reflect and see today's events in light of history, gives us a little perspective.